Okay, so you can break the quest because you're technically allowed to attack anything. Rangers, before we if you want to keep the option for non-lethal measures open. Very well. I have programmed it to remain inert after it opens the glass door. Well, that's one fucked up laser. Charge! Where's the charge? No charge? Why aren't they charging? Are you? Where is Ludlow? Did that weasel send someone else to do his dirty work? Finally! Someone who sees the truth! But he wasn't the whole problem. This endless push is inhumane. We want to know when we'll be able to... It started when Markham hired Ludlow and sicked him on us. All of a sudden, things that had been rights were now privileges. Privileges we had to pay for. Need to go to the bathroom? Pay Ludlow. Want to see your kids? Pay Ludlow. Have an accident on the floor and... The working conditions were bad enough, but with that psycho running security, it was literally simple. Let us see our families. Give us a schedule that doesn't... We won't even bitch about having to sleep in the factory until the end of the push. Sure, Ludlow's death buys her a reprieve. But if our demands aren't met soon, we'll sit on our hands until the gangs get here and kill us all. Tell her she's on the floor. Things just bought. No, the moon. Is that a doctor? No, oh, cool. Let me steal the other thing for the um, scientific science, whatever bullshit. There's no science behind it. Alright, the uh, fire. This is Steel Town's job placement area where Assistant Bianchi oversees the testing of new. Welcome back. It says here, fire was successfully suppressed. For a while, at least. Here's your fire suppressor bonus. Want to look for another job? Let's look again. Let's check your... Please step up on the treadmill. <laughs> let's go... All right, let's based on the results of... A tick... Oh, nut tight. Good luck.
This appears to be a... Yeah, I think at this point it doesn't do anything anymore. Welcome back. Great. Want to look for another job? Soup. Come back soon. Uh, right. Stealing, stealing. Biometric governors for me. Great, thank you, Rangers. But before I pay you, let's make sure Ivan and BF tank their presentation. Fantastic. I'll get things going. Greetings, Administrator. I will now present my project. It is titled EEG Driven Sleep Productivity Inducer. I'm ready. The average admin worker spends 29.645% of each day unconscious. My EEG system reads their brain waves during REM sleep and then stimulates feedback through minimally invasive neuroelectrodes. As a result, workers can collate data and execute basic clerical functions while dreaming. Interesting. That could be extremely valuable, if it works. To demonstrate, I will induce sleep in myself with anesthetic. Please observe the work terminal at my station. Governor to avoid the season of recent feedback loop. She's now in a vegetative state. Disappointing. Administrator Markham, I set out with one simple goal change the world. And <laughs> damn it, I did just that. Presenting the worker incentive system. Get to it, Ivan. Uh, right. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> ah, as you know, we lose three man weeks a day to meal breaks. What if instead, workers got their nutrition at their stations as a reward for meeting quotas? Drive five rivets, out pops a pellet. Well, the joint, out pops another. Intriguing. Show me. So you just strap on the feed bag, and when a goal is met, a little pellet is automatically dispensed for the worker to chow down on. Mmm. <laughs> Delicious. I... What? Another one? I'm not done with... Ah! Too many pellets! Stop it! Make it... <laughs> Ivan clearly needed a second biometric governor to prevent an exponentially accelerating dopamine reward feedback loop. Disappointing. What an unbelievable waste. Both projects failed, and we'll have to ramp up two new researchers. Enrico, get on that. Yes, ma'am. As they deserve. Wow. Talk about karma. Not only did BF and Ivan's projects crap the bed, they're out of the picture entirely. My pleasure. So long. Okay. 